Good morning. Today is to Monday, uh, October 23, 2017. We're blazing through October. I'm super uh, amazed at how quickly October's gone by. I don't know where it went. It just feels like it's just been a big rush. Like, I already know, like, next Monday is practically our, um, actually, I don't even know. Let me check my calendar. Um, yeah, next Monday is going to be the um, monthly meeting and it's always kind of weird when it comes to that monthly meeting because like that's just like an indicator that we're moving on and pushing on through the year so it just felt like that we just had it yesterday like the like the September one and now here we are in the October one next thing you know it'll be November and it'll be December and then break and then there'll be like pretty much like five months left of school and that sounds like it's a long time but I've already like with me I already know what the, the curriculum is gonna be um, all all that's really left is like do the day by day, make sure everything's good, uh, make sure that my kids learn something worthwhile. Um, and I I don't know, it's just um, I, I just I'm I'm surprised that things are going so quickly. At any rate, um, what's what's going on with me today? Well, you know we're gonna I, I honestly I feel like I don't have really a plan today. Um, I'm still gonna, I'm still kind of making it, but I think I can like uh, put one together in about 15 or 20 minutes, and um, it just because it's it, like like I said, a lot of the planning I did was in was in August, and it feels a little weird that I don't have that feeling of like oh what am I gonna do today or maybe I do, but then like it's not nowhere near as like bad as it was last year or two years ago or even my first year obviously, um, and it's just it's it's so it's so crazy now I feel like I got some extra time. Um, right now, it's just a matter of like picking my strategy, look at what needs to be done, review the content, and then execute. And you know that could all be, all be done within like thirty minutes. The thing is, you know, I should really start being just to go right back to where I was and then start planning again, like like in the old days. I don't know why um, I'm not doing that. At any rate, that's what is what's been going on today. Um, you know, it's crazy. Report cards are due on Wednesday. Actually, no. The yeah 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 yeah. yeah. The, the quarter itself ends tomorrow, which is crazy. And then the report cards are due on Wednesday, which is even crazier. And I just can't believe that it's just like, um, that it's going like that. And it just went like that. I knew like when the progress reports were gonna come out, I knew it was gonna be like this. Um, anyway, um, I'm trying to, you know, I had a pretty good weekend, uh, pretty restful, went to the city, kind of got myself recharged, um, seeing like, um, I saw a play on, um, on what essentially is like a coming of age story for a Filipino American, and um, the one that really stuck out was how this guy It Leong, a uh, he was actually a union, uh, I think, grape worker, and he was Filipino that worked with Cesar Chavez to you know basically give workers rights, and it just put things into perspective that you know I have it easy, um, like I get to work. Yes, my job is difficult. Okay, I'm not gonna get that. I'm not gonna like uh, uh, run around that. But my job is difficult, and from the looks of it, it's a very lucrative. I would say luxury. Like if you were to compare it to the original, like the Mexican and the Filipinos who worked out in the fields, it's pretty luxurious because you know I have, I brought a fridge from home. I got some. Oh, I, I've got access to cold water. I've got access to food. Um, you know, I get breaks, uh, regular breaks, and actually, I might actually get more breaks than the typical profession, just because I got the prep period, which sometimes has this. You know, I have to sub in and stuff. But um, you know, it's just one of those things that, like, I feel like I, I think about it, and then I have a lot more control about my job than I than back in the day and you know I really gotta thank um Eat Leon and Cesar Chavez for it. So I'm really mindful about that now. Um just like just remembering that my job is easier than what they've had to go through. What they had to go through had was just like there's no support at at the very at the very least, you know, they only had each other. Um anyway I'm rambling but I don't know. I just think it was just some really interesting thing. Um what can I what else can I say about that? Um yeah, um, I'm just going to do my best today. Um, I, I woke up, I, I stayed up late uh, playing video games again. It was like midnight, so I woke up kind of like grumbly, but I'm like, I think I'm over it, I think. Um, but yeah, um, I, I'm feeling pretty good. 
about today. So let's just uh, hope for a good day. Um, and yeah, uh, I hope my students learned something today. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Actually, I might not be here tomorrow. I'm actually, uh, there's a, I got a family thing to deal with and maybe. We'll see. All right, bye.